Hi, this is Justin at wingsound.com. This video is about creating a click track in Pro Tools 8. So once you have your beat, you want all your instruments in time. So this is the perfect video for that. One way to create the click track is you could go to track, create click track, very easy, sets it up for you. Open up your plugin, change whatever you need to change for your music. And the other way to do it is you can create a new audio file and instantiate the click plugin on it. So one benefit of this is you can record the click as an audio file if you need to use that for something. Okay, so I have these two drum samples here and the first one is 100 BPM and the second is 120 BPM with a 2-4 time signature. So the first one I already set to 100 BPM and to do that you could just double click on this first marker here and just type in your BPM and you could change the note if you want and if you click this arrow it opens up so you could see it better visually and if you need to create another uh, point to for your tempo change you grab the pencil tool and you could just put a dot there and fix that however you need to fix or you can go to freehand and you can draw in crazy tempo changes if, if you want to do that and if you want to delete any tempo changes that you've created just highlight it and drag it over till it reaches the BPM where you want it to go back to and just hit delete and it goes back so this one here I need to change to 120 so you could just grab it move it where you need to and again double click on it and you can type in your BPM if you know the exact location you could type that in as well and change the note okay so that's done now what I need to do is change the meter so the beginning is 4-4 which is good and that's what I need and the second one goes to 2-4 so just put your cursor where you need it and hit the plus sign and it creates another one and same thing here if you know your exact location you could type it in and type in your time signature changes so there you go so once it hits here it's going to change to 24 with 120 bpm and that sounds like this you can always get in touch with justin at wingsound.com and check out more of justin's videos including these titles featuring the new pro tools 8 now available on demand at wingsound.com